So here we are with the new update. We're using the new LMG, but mainly it is going to be about the new uh, stealth bomber. I unlocked everything for it you can possibly do, and I think I found the very best setup. So I want to do some gameplay with it. Kind of a guide on how to use it and see if we can make it work in pub games, which is a little bit of a challenge, I would say. So first thing we need to just get 80 points in control, which is a uh, game mode they've added again uh, for the next, I think, two weeks you can play this. There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, we got it. So redeploy quickly. Hopefully I'm on time. There you go. Alright, so we got the 20 mils. We have the invincible thing. And we have the kerosene bomb. Which we can use here right away. The kerosene bomb is extremely good. Um... So the counterpart of the stealth bomber is that you don't really have flares to counter um, any heat-seeking missiles with, which is a real challenge, I can tell you that. Oh, we didn't kill that guy. So that's what I mean. Alright, so now we got an incoming missile, which we just have to take. But now... We'll go invisible. It's kind of the only thing we can do here. Oh, I can't hit this guy. Alright, we're getting locked on. There we go. Okay, we got the kill. Any players there? There we go. Okay, we have to play it smart with this hill here, otherwise we're just kind of doomed. We'll wait for our um, invisible thing to be back, there we go. And let's see if we can go for a strafe here. I'm just trying to stay in cover as much as I can. Alright, so let's go for a strafe. I think this um, ability lasts for about 10 seconds. Is that a player? That is... oh! <laughs> wow! There we go. Ooh, that was almost a little too low. Okay, we can go back now pretty fast. Should be. Where can we drop the bomb? Right here? There we go, beautiful. The kerosene bomb can destroy buildings really easily. Um, the JDM is kind of good to destroy vehicles with, but if you want to farm, the, the kerosene bomb is definitely the better option. Oh, there's... It will try and go for their, um... Their stealth bomber right away. I don't want it to know that I'm coming for him. Oh, what's it gonna do? Oh, beautiful. Also, you have the AP rounds, which I just wouldn't recommend using because the 20 mils are really good for taking out the uh, cell bomber. There we go. I think there was another player next to it. The reason why I'm going invisible every time is. Ooh, there is a. Uh, wow. Uh, let's pull up before it's too late. Uh, the reason why I'm going invisible every time is so they don't lock onto me already. Okay, let's try and fly low here. Wait for the ability to be back. Would expect some players here. Right there. Oh, beautiful. Alright, as long as they don't have two players coming for me. Should be fine now. A little assist right there. And instantly I'm turboing away. So you go for a strafe and then you use the turbo and then you should be fine. Oh, 
another one. Go fast and then fly low. That seems to be the best way to survive in this thing. I definitely struggle myself to get multiple kills um, in one strafe. There we go again. Now I can use the beautiful bomb. Alright, here? Yep, there you go. It looks like they have an AA tank now. Yeah, this, okay, so now we're in a little bit of a um, struggle. Now we got a tank that could literally hit two rockets and then it's done. Just like that. Okay, so we gotta go far in a this rocket. Okay, now we just have to wait because uh, there is no counter right now. So when you're below, I think like 58 HP, you should probably just wait uh, for a good recovery. Okay, I think we're gonna be fine. We're gonna take the risk. And uh, strafe away. <laughs> oh, we got two assists as well there. It might be the AA that's locking on to me. Oh, okay, they have another, and we're flying low instantly. Ah, uh, this is uh, the best way to uh, to survive in the um, the stealth bomber. Actually, wait for the uh, invisible um, perk to be back. There we go. I hope they didn't see me. They can still walk onto you um, when you're invisible. Yeah, they're instantly locked. They're not happy with me anymore. <laughs> yeah, we'll stay low. Uh, we give ourselves a little bit of range. Oh, wow, okay. Yep, we gotta wait, we gotta wait. Preferably stay a little bit low. We got another stealth bomber, which... Oh, I think that's... I think that was a attack helicopter there. Not ideal. Drop the bomb from high this time. Nice. Alright, now we slow it down a little bit more even. I think the weakest point of the stealth bomber is actually uh, the jets. Because the jets have lock-on missiles and they can just chase you down. And that's the main thing you want to be watching out for. Right, let's get out of here. Uh, I do have the bomb. Nice thing with the bomb is you can quickly drop it so you don't have to prepare a full strafe. Uh, let's see. Somewhere here should be good. Beautiful. Uh, let's go for a normal strafe now. Oh, no way. Wow. Okay. I don't know if that was bad aim or just bad hit wrench. I felt like uh, when they're behind, when they're against a hill like that, they should usually be quite easy uh, to kill. And I will wait for some health to come back. You can you can just not take two hits uh, quickly after each other. Okay, I'm regaining some health. Okay. I hope he's not gonna be able to lock onto me now. Ooh, this could be good. Triple. Oh, one. Oh, there's another stealth bomber. I don't know if I want to be going for him right now. That's the only tricky thing. Okay, it's flying above me. I gotta watch the other stealth bomber. It's hard to dogfight when there's players locking onto you.
And now, okay, now we're at the last objective where there's only one objective to take. But their spawn is super predictable, so we might be able to get some good uh, double kills. Attack helicopter is coming for me. Yeah, that's pretty tough. This is tough. I hope that's one rocket, dude. Okay, we're good. Now we gotta just uh, stay a little bit more patient. So we can get behind the hill in time. We could try and go for the chopper here, it's a little risky. Okay. I'll go for the bomb instead. I'm gonna hope we don't get locked on, otherwise I'm dead. And it's definitely game over. We can help out a little bit on the objective. Oh, that was not a good hit. Not very happy with that one. Okay, we can take one hit, so we're gonna play a little bit more risky here. Oh, I got lucky there. Like I said, chopper doesn't hit me, we're good. And the game is almost over. I don't think we're gonna win this one anymore. But hopefully this is kind of a good guide on how to play with the stealth bomber. Um, and honestly, sometimes you just get unlucky. When players really go for you, it's really hard to survive in this thing. Uh, because there's no flares, so there's no counter to heat seeking missiles. So we can drop one more bomb here. That would be kind of nice, right there. Oh, beautiful triple. I hope that allows us to capture the objective back. It's still possible uh, to get a comeback here. Oh no, dude! That was too late. That was too late. I tried to drop some bombs quickly. 3072 though with the new stealth bomber. Hopefully that was a useful uh, guide on how to play with this and how to be effective with this. Uh, it was a full game, no AI. Uh, so I think it represents uh, a pretty normal uh, server, I guess. Uh, with the stealth bomber, so be sure to try out the setup, upgrade the bomber a little bit, and uh, see how good you can be uh, with it.